Greetings, this is Gintian, and today we are playing on The Veil on Minecraft 20.1. And I am ready for work on the sorting system. It needs to be expanded because it doesn't sort enough. So... I'm over here. I'm going to gather up some of the components I need. So with that in mind, we can now go over and look at the changes I have made. I have expanded this room out even further worked on the floor yes I know those copper corroded added a lot of space gotta say it is awesome to do with the beacon and I just need to start by expanding out these four smooth block out further down the line so that I can expand this sorting system to add more. I'm going to take these out of the way. I'm eventually going to have to take the whole staircase out of the way. But we can start with this. And I want to make sure I got all my materials lined up. So now I got two stacks of those. So let's start placing them. And we'll see how this goes. How far down do I want to go? Well, I, well, further than this. So with that in mind, let's go ahead and dig this out. And you can see what kind of power you get With the beacon it's just way cool it's insta mining rock stone sometimes you run into problems where you just want to take one block and you can't because it, this mines so fast I actually need to start carrying a weaker pick so I can remove those one blocks at a time. But I haven't done that yet. We're just leveling this out. And then we'll see how far we want this to go. I think I'll. I have an inventory problem. This shouldn't be surprising. Now I can pick up all these stone blocks, or at least some of them. And I think I want to add, I do want it to come further down. I didn't know this. This wasn't exactly the same level as the wall. And now it is. See what I mean by punching holes by mistake? And we'll take that to say there. That's only a small part of it done, but I think I'm going to do some more and then give you an update. So let me work on that and then I will be right back. I'm back and I need repeaters. The good news is, is I actually have some repeaters in my redstone box. So I'm going to find that and then I can start putting the repeaters down. 
So see you in a minute. Well, that uses up the 17 repeaters that I currently have. So I'm going to have to make more. However, I can fill these in as far as it will go. Okay, and now I'm out of I don't have enough repeaters. I don't have any more comparators. I need more chests as well as hoppers. So I'm going to go work on all of that and be back. Welcome back. I have done enough sorting for now. I still can think of more items that should be in this sorter but uh, I've ran out of room again because now we're up against this wall but I have finished all of the hoppers and all of the redstone behind it and so now I can just show you what I have sorted things into and if we come down here we have our dirt I want to just sort some wheat we have our copper, our tarnished copper. Um, this is polished basalt. This is tough. Our three lights, our sand. Uh, this is just pure copper. So if I want that to be shiny have to fix that. Then I have two gravel and these are non-polished basalts and then these two are for mud bricks and these are for mud and these are for packed mud. Do I have any? Nope. Bone. Um, Diorite. These are for cobbled deep splate. And this is just deep slate. And this is tiled deep slate. Deep slate tiles. You get the idea. And this is currently dull deep slate, but this is actually not correct. These should all be polished deep slate. So these have to go back into the sorter. I was still trying to figure these out. And here is stone bricks, cobblestone, smooth stone, and last but not least, stone stone. So that's the idea. I've been, I increased the ceiling. I added some lights, gotten rid, rid of a lot of bo uh, boxes and sharper boxes and reinforced this staircase. This actually was one of the originals that goes all the way down to the bottom of the world and of course here's my beacon I've added lights all the way back this is probably a little further back than last time you saw it currently this is a hole I'm working on that but I'll have to that's too much of an explanation so I will have to do that in the future. For now, I think it's just a matter of doing some resource gathering. 
on which ones I want next. And I know I want more mud. And I know I want more packed mud. That's going to involve two projects. One is a mud farm. Another is a giant method for harvesting a lot of wheat. And we'll go from there. So that's my next two projects. But you can see here we're making pretty good progress. I have all my shock shulker boxes stored in virtual PV1, which I can type PV1, which is personal vaults, something we get on this server. This is an additional large amount of storage, and we actually do get two of them. And this is where I am holding all my shulker boxes, plus a few spare items. And so as I fill these back up, I can keep these things reasonably organized using my storage systems and using the personal storage capabilities that I gain on this server. Plus, I will have to practice something resembling inventory control. So, there we have it. Please subscribe, like, and click on the bell so that you can be notified of future content. For members of the Vale, how do I get cursed fishing rods? As always, thank you so much for watching, and goodbye.